the race is 7.6 miles up. It is, by many measures, the steepest hill climb, if not North America, the world. Overall, we're looking at an average grade of 12%. You end at 22% of the wall. First third of the race is the steepest third. Uh, you need a chain brake tool? A lot of people will completely burn out. Oh, I'm done. This mountain, it's the true testament of the cycling will. You never know what you're capable of unless you try. That's what this whole thing has been about for me. Ryan Hall was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease as a teenager. And tomorrow at age 60, the New Hampshire native is planning to do the Mount Washington Auto Road Bicycle Hill Climb. The bike is a miracle. I am physically free in a way I can't be on anything else in this world right now. This is the one day a year I can be like everyone else. time taking part in the race and he's hoping to finish it in two hours. You got it, brother. Thank you for coming to the 39th annual Mount Washington Hill Climb. And they're off. Wave two. Good luck. This race, it's such a big commitment, physically, mentally. The result doesn't matter to me. The real joy of this is in the sense of freedom. I get to leave Parkinson's behind and hopefully achieve the summit. Brian's like a Dart weaving in and out of riders. I'm going along, I'm, I'm huffing and puffing, and I'm like, can I keep up with him? Everything is going by so fast. Good job, buddy. Good job. People are cheering him on. Brian, you're an inspiration. Nice job, Brian. Thank you. Thank you. Inspiring, brother. Thank you, Brian. Thank you. We had a plan going into this. Hey, Brian, mile three, let's pull over, let's get some water in you. I'm realizing like, okay, we're beyond mile three. We're beyond mile four. And I'm like, hey, he hasn't stopped. He is willing himself to the top, and he has on his shoulders just people cheering him on. Yeah. Very good book. It's awesome. Oh. Thank you. Thank you very much. You inspired my best friend's father. Oh. Yes, Parkinson's. Oh, wow. Well, we'll talk at the bar. All right, brother. Thank you. Thank you. We get to fourth mile, I'm thinking, geez, four miles already? I was shocked. Went to six miles, I said, I'm not stopping. His cadence is only increasing. He's getting 
faster as he gets to the top. The crowd is roaring, a whole orchestra of sound. I didn't know it was possible for me to do that. I'm so proud of you. So hard to do. 2019. It was three hours, four minutes. Right. Today was what, an hour and 50? I'm happy for you, Brian. Bill, that bike's amazing. Well, the, the bike is only half the tool. You're the other half. So you, Kill, it ain't going anywhere by itself, is it? So you called me a tool? Oh, yeah. I think he just did call you I'll a call tool. I called you a tool. <laughs> when we try to do something we're not sure if we can do, and we do it, that's a gift of growth. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> You're, you are a, a ridiculous. If there's one thing I could share with people about my story is never give up, never quit. I hope this gives all the people hope in their lives that they are capable of doing more than they thought they could.